What's up guys, Jim Majek, IFBB Pro here at Chief Fitness. Gonna do the dumbbell press. Um, definitely one of the best all-time movements you can do for your chest. Um, dumbbells don't trap you into their range of motion like a barbell does. So it's a little safer for the joints, especially if you're controlling the weight and you're warmed up. Um, I love the contraction at the top. Um, you can kind of self-adjust. Everybody has different levels of mobility. Um, you definitely um, can kind of feel those shoulder joints stretch the bottom of the movement. Um, I don't recommend doing half reps. A lot of times you'll see guys come in, they want to use the big dumbbells, they want to use the heavy weights, and so they'll, they'll only go down halfway, kind of like squirm their way up. That's definitely not the way to do this. Full range of motion is best, but you have to keep those shoulders healthy too. And if you leave those, if you dip those dumbbells down too, too low, um, it does put your, your connective tissues in like a precarious position. So with that in mind, I recommend warming up. Use light dumbbells first, stretch out your shoulders, stretch out your chest a little bit in between your warm up sets. Um, get your rotator cuffs good to go. So you don't tear a rotator cuff or labrum and you're good to go. So any, anyhow, some tips, as you get stronger with dumbbells, you're gonna have to either have guys hand you the dumbbells or you can get a, grab one at a time here. Um, as you travel back, you wanna kinda press up. So I kinda start with my knees, travel back, press up, and now I'm ready to press. I don't like to slam the dumbbells at the top, together at the top. I wanna keep constant tension on it. So I do that full descent, come down, not too far down, just about right here. Come up and in and squeeze. Down, up, in. Up, and you almost wanna act like you're gonna to touch the inner parts of your elbow right here together. So as you come up, you're squeezing that chest. You're not snapping your elbows, you're squeezing the chest up. Stretch, contract, stretch, contract. Whenever I'm done, I come down, top of the knees, get some momentum there, and drop the dumbbells. Um, one thing, if you drop a dumbbell, you definitely have to have some experience. If I'm gonna drop a dumbbell, you want both, both of these sides to hit at the same time. You don't want it to hit on the ends or one side at a time. You want to drop the dumbbell evenly. Um, Thankfully, our strong guys here, even with the 150s, the 170s that I've seen some guys press, they bring them back to their legs and then drop them from there. A lot safer for everybody. Um, it definitely doesn't break a dumbbell. So, so keep that in mind for sure. But yeah, warm up guys, use proper tempo. Don't go too fast. Don't slam to the top. Don't bounce off the bottom and you'll be good to go. Great movement, give them a shot. Thanks for uh, watching and give us a follow to Chief Fitness Pueblo. Chief Fitness.